Hey guys, um, this is another weight loss video because I feel like I needed to come on here and rant. I'm sorry if you see like a bunch of stuff in the background. We had um, we had an exterminator come out and we had to take everything out of the cabinet so it's all sitting on the table. Um, Liam, get down. Sorry, he's climbing on stuff. I just want to make this video because I'm really mad and I don't know what I'm supposed to do and it's pissing me off. Okay, I'm, I guess, a compulsive layer. I weigh myself every day and sometimes multiple times a day and I've stopped, I've stopped doing it multiple times a day for the most part, um, but I still weigh myself every day, and I know I shouldn't, I know I should weigh myself at the beginning of the week, and then weigh myself at the end of the week, so it's not, like, a discouraging thing, but the thing that pisses me off really bad is, for the past two weeks, my weight has just been stupid, like, I one day I weigh this amount, and the next day I weigh this amount, like a pound difference. And I know I didn't eat bad the day before. I weighed, like, I've been eating good, except for maybe one or two days where I didn't eat very well. And it was only one thing that I ate that I didn't eat very well. And I work out every day, and I bust my ass at the gym. And I don't understand what's going on. Like, yesterday when I came on here, I was 168.6. And then when I weighed myself this morning, knowing I had eaten well the day before and the day before that, didn't go over my calories, ate good things, fruits, vegetables, whole wheat, everything I'm supposed to be eating and doing right, I weighed myself this, this morning and I was 170. How does that happen? And it's, d it's done that all week and last week. And... So I don't know what the hell my weight is because it keeps going up and down, up and down, up and down daily. And then at the end of a week's time, it's either up or down by a few ounces and it doesn't make any sense because I'm working hard, I'm drinking a lot of water, I'm eating the way that I'm supposed to, yet the scale, and I have two, they're both doing it. That doesn't make any sense. And then and a couple of people have said, um, well... Muscle weighs more than fat. That's not true. It's a myth. It, they actually weigh the same amount. A pound of muscle is the same as a pound of fat. Um, so, I mean, people keep telling me to pay attention to inches and not, not the number on the scale, but that's really hard because, one, I don't measure myself, and two, I just, your whole life you're told most people are told it's a certain number, you need to get down to this way, um, yada yada yada, but, like, the BMI scale or whatever, but, like, I can't get out of these, these few pounds, like, I'm stuck, and I keep going up and down, and I know I'm not doing anything bad, and that's what makes me so upset, is I'm doing everything I'm supposed to do, I'm, I'm getting enough rest, I'm exercising every day. I was losing more weight when I was doing everything at home and hardly exercising at all. And then now that I'm eating better and doing it the right way and exercising hardcore, it's not working. And it, it it's like I want to just give up and be like, I'm, I can't do this. My body's just not going to let me lose weight. It let me it let me lose those first 18 pounds and then now it's just gonna plateau and stay this way and I'm gonna gain weight out of freaking nowhere so and I know this sounds really stupid and I'm ranting because I'm mad but ugh, it's annoying to lose weight and then the next day see that you've gained it back when you didn't do anything to gain it back and I know your weight fluctuates every day but I just, I don't understand, and it's really, 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 really making me sad, mad, upset. Um, I guess I'm taking this whole weight loss, getting healthy thing too seriously, or maybe I'm wanting it too quick, but, I mean, I don't think a pound or two pounds a week is too much to ask for, especially when I'm doing things the right way. Um, not this staying the same, or freaking going up instead of down crap.
Um, I don't know. Sorry, I'm just really freaking mad. And I know I need to stop obsessing over this whole weight loss thing because A, that's how eating disorders are created is the obsession, the, the control, the, and all this other stuff. And I don't want that. And two, it's just, it's making, it's making my bipolar episodes worse. Um, it's sending me into a depressive spiral, if that makes sense. Like, it's making me mad, for one, which I, I don't need because I already have the irritability. And two, it's pushing me down into the whole, you can't do anything right, da da da, etc, 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 aspect of the bipolar disorder. So, that's how I'm doing today. I'm really mad, I'm really upset, and I'm really just disappointed in my body. Um, I know I should be happy with the 20 pounds, but there's just so, or not 20 pounds, excuse me, 18, there's just so many things about my body that I hate right now, and I, I'll never be able to fix. Um, like, the issues with my abdomen and the way that it sits and, and all that crap from the surgeries and if I didn't have that there I'm pretty sure I would be a little bit more satisfied with my body if I didn't have that huge just mass of messed up stomach it wouldn't look so bad and I'd be a little bit happier and I wouldn't care about that number maybe but I don't know I'm just rambling on at this point because I really don't know what I'm supposed to say <sighs> It's irritating, and I'm really pissed off. But my friend ordered Insanity, so we're gonna stay at the gym probably another month, month and a half. Um, I want to lose at least five more pounds before I start Insanity. I'm not gonna start Insanity until I get to a decent weight and feel like I am healthy enough to do that. I need to get a heart rate monitor thing all that other crap before I start that because I do have an issue with my heart getting up there in the, in ranges when I work out really hard like you know how some people push you like a personal trainer will push you really hard to to do certain workouts and you feel like your chest is going to explode and your heart is just going way too fast well mine really does um, I get up into like the 180s I've gotten up to 200 before during workouts, so I have to, I can't do, like, these hard, hardcore workouts, and that's what I'm scared of with insanity, so I want to keep doing some cardio to try to strengthen that, I guess, I don't know, I don't know, I'm so confused, I don't know what I'm talking about, anyways, I'll talk to you guys later, bye.